Hello and welcome again to Every Belgian Beer. Uh, it's very sunny, but I'll take off my sunglasses. <laughs> look like a balloon. Today we'll be trying Blanche de Namur, Blanche de Namur uh, Rosé. There, um, there, this seems to be quite a new beer. I've only come across it quite recently. Um, I today in the supermarket. <laughs> I've tried uh, Blanche de Namur. Ordinary one, the ordinary one, the ordinary wheat beer, and this um, has the um, the addition of uh, raspberry juice. So lots of breweries seem to be making a, a lot more uh, fruit beers now, in my humble opinion. Um, it's made by uh, the Bock Brasserie, Bock, Bock Brewery. It's a fruit beer. Uh, says it should be served in a flute um, but I can't be bothered um, to go and getting one and dirtying one of my, my father-in-law's um, flutes. I'm still in Belgium here, lovely and sunny. It's about 30 degrees today and this should be an ideal day to try this. It's 3.4% um, and uh, let's see how it tastes. coming out pink with uh, not much of a head at all. The head's, well it's a bit of a head but it's disappearing fairly quickly. Looks like a grapefruit kind of colour um, and you can smell the raspberry. It's um, apparently Blanche, as in Blanche de Namur, was a 14th century um, princess in France and the king of Norway uh, came over and she then went to live in Norway, became the queen of Norway and Sweden and Scania. I'm not entirely sure where Scania is. And in memory, according to Brock, uh, Bock, in memory of her sweetness and beauty and charm, they made the Blanche de Namur. So this is where this comes from as well. Head is almost gone there. Um, um, mm, you really taste the the raspberry. Um, it tastes quite a quite a processed taste. Very very sweet, uh, fruity as you'd expect. But there is kind of a, a chemically taste to it. Um, it's not bad. Kind of sticks to your mouth a bit. It's, I wouldn't say it's the most refreshing of beers, um, and the aftertaste may be a little bit too processed for my for my liking. Um, still. It's okay. It's nice. I thought I would try it because I, I saw it today and I, I had enjoyed the, the ordinary Blanche de Namur, the ordinary wheat beer. Uh, if you like fruit beers, give it a go. There are better. There are worse. But overall, it's not too bad. I hope that's been enlightening to you for this newish beer. And thanks for watching Every Belgian Beer. And I'll see you again. Bye.